Gotta keep those lips moist, you know what I'm saying? Keep them puckered. You can put that in the intro of the video, by the way. Strap on your big person pants, because we're getting into it. Don't mind what's behind me. Over there, in the distance. I know you're watching it, waiting for a scare, but there's nothing there. Nothing at all. It's the 90s, everybody. The scariest period in anyone's life. If you were boring during that period, you know how scary it truly was. To go to the VHS store? You couldn't just watch stuff at home? Oh, snap! I'm gonna be late for work. <laughs> if only rent was cheaper in Firemore, I wouldn't have to work night shifts every day. That's true. And if only I didn't have these damn moon shoes on, I'd be able to actually get there on time. What is this? What are you watching? Can I actually interact with any of this? Whoa. We are short. Short King. Alrighty. Let's just head out to work then. Go outside. Yes. Why not? Wow. I live in a nice place. Being able to go outside and see all of those stars from your house? Good for you. Are you a murderer? Are you a murderer that's sitting there murdererly? Getting ready to murder me? Are you a murderer sitting there murdererly? Getting ready to murder me in my sleep? Or while I'm at work? I should get to the bus station. I don't want to be late. Okay. Is this- is this the- Hey! 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 hey. Whoa! 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 Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> Why? I was having a great time until you- Huh? Okay, God. <laughs> That's fun. Good for you. Good intro. Good intro. Strong. What kind of movies are we watching? Is that Desperado? Uh, these are actually movies and I don't know which one is which. I don't know the covers of these. It's the 90s. What are people watching? Pretty Woman? Coraline! There's the Dark Knight down there. I recognize that one. Is that Blade? <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. Is that the Curious Case of Benjamin Button? No, it's not. It kind of looks like something like that. <laughs> what other ones do we have? I want to figure this out. God, some of them look so familiar too, but I don't know what movies are attached to them. Anyway, it's not my job to look at tapes. It's my job to rent them. What is this? A Sonata? Hey man, sorry for today. I had to leave a bit early, you know? I've got a date with that hot chick I told you about. Oh yeah. Bro, it's fine to put off your civic duties if you got a date with a hot chick. You can do anything you want if you're dating hot people. Anyway, don't forget to take out the trash. I'll tell you when- how it went tomorrow night. I won't be able to find out because I'll be dead tomorrow night. Dude, nice computer. How much ROM you got- or RAM you got in that? ROM? <laughs> how much RAM you got in that? Like 12 KB? Dude, that's tight. So how do I do my job? Why am I working a night shift at a video rental place? Can't you just close before nighttime? Okay, take out the- oh wait, take out the trash. Lock it. Nice, got a pooper. Is that carpeted? A carpeted bathroom? People really were psychos back in the 90s, weren't they? Bing bong. Um, bins, bins, yes. Right there, Sunny Jims. Is that not a bin? Where do I- Okay, I keep clicking out of the game! Why is that even a thing that I can do? Put away the trash! It doesn't go here either? Where does it go? Where does a man put trash in this stinky game? There, I put it. That dude was hauling ass. Dude had a dirt bike car. <laughs> Where are you going so fast? Maybe that was the guy with the date with a hot chick. Yeah, you got to get there quick and rev up your engine. Otherwise, you're not cool enough to date them. Alright, what else do I do for the rest of my job? Maybe you can actually just sit down and watch a movie. Ooh! 
customer. Hello, what are you getting? Hi, hi. Oh, you're bringing these back. Um. Uh, thank you? Where do I put them? <laughs> what do I do with them? No, no, thank you. Thank you very much. Oh. Hello, my dear. I'd like to return these tapes my husband got last week. Such great, lovely stories. We both like watching romantic movies when we are alone in the house. Hee <laughs> hee. Anyway, I'm kind of nervous coming here alone at night. An old lady like me shouldn't be out late at night anyway. Yeah, you should probably be dead in a grave or something, right? Or a hospital? Oh lord, what am I saying? All those cases with missing people lately scare me. And to think that Firemore was a peaceful town back in my days. Well, your days are over, Hannah. It's time for the new fresh blood to power through. Anyway, I'll go now. Sorry for bothering you with all my rumbling. Rumbling! Rumbling! It's coming! Rumbling! Rumbling! Burr, burr. I know this one. This is a poster that I think my brother had. This looks like Barbarian, but it's not. Um, okay. Where does a guy put tapes? In this place. Not there. Not here. Not here. They, they, Hannah better rewound these. She didn't. I'm gonna find where she lives. I know where she lives. It's a small town. We all know each other. Ah, there you go. Back on that shelf, of course. Oh my god! There's a giant! Who's this giant coming in? Hide! Hello, welcome to VHS store. Uh, hi? Hey, man. Oh, crap. Could you give me a tape and I'll pay you back once I have the money? What? What do you mean, no? Come on, man! I can't give out free stuff. Look, I'm 17 years old. I'm doing this job just so I can pay my way through college when I get there. Alright? I'm not getting paid minimum wage. I don't have any benefits. I don't even like this job. My friend is dating all the hot chicks. There's literally no reason for me to be here other than the fact that I have nothing else to do in my life. Pfft. Your tapes are crap anyway. It's the same energy as... Your moves are weak. Look, you're working at night all alone here. I don't think you'd like to piss off the wrong person. Is it you, Rob? No one can do anything worse to me than I've already done to myself by being here. Remember that. Okay. Dude's built like an orangutan. Dude's got arms that are like twice the length they should be. Bye, Rob. My shift is finished. Time to go home, I guess. Dude, this job is easy. <laughs> So easy! I had to come in here, talk to Hannah and Rob, and now I get to go home? Whose cars are these? Actually, that's a good question. No one else is working here. The people who just came in left and didn't actually take any cars. So who owns the cars? Why are there cars here? Can I have one? Ah, back home. Oh, come on now. You gonna be late again? Where did my mirror go? I had a mirror there! Mirror, mirror on the wall! Where the fuck did you go? <laughs> also, how are you gonna be late again? Did you just sleep all day? Well, sitting around here is not gonna make me any faster. Dum da dum dum dum, back to my job at the VHA store. Boom 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 dum 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 da dum. I guess I'm not a 17 year old paying for college if I live on my own at home in my own house. I'm a very... The van's gone. I'm a very resourceful 17-year-old. I got kicked out. Emancipated. Is that what it is? What's the thing where you can get... You can go, like, live on your own when you're, like, 16, but you need to, like, tell your parents and they need to sign something and let you go or... Something, I don't know. E e emancipation? No, I don't think that that's it. God! Oh, it is emancipation. Free from legal, social, or political restrictions. Yeah. A legal way for children to become adults before they're 18. I nailed that. Emancipation just sounded different. Like it sounded way more political than I thought. Where'd the cars go? I hope he lets me know how his date with the hot chick went. I'm so eager to know. 
Hey Greg, it's Matt. Sorry for leaving early. Again. Something urgent came up. Anyway, the date went really well. I really think Mary likes me. Oh, also I finally fixed the surveillance camera. You can see at the top right of the counter. And please don't forget to take out the trash. Why don't you take it on your way out? Where did he say that? Ah. Oh. Cool. I'm sure that's not going to be terrifying. Also... Why can't I get out here? Bloody bin is right there! This is just taking up time and effort and energy. Then again, nothing else ever happens at this job. Might as well walk the scenic route. Ah, what a lovely night it is to be murdered. Hopefully not me. Let's just stare at the surveillance camera until I get really paranoid and freak out and then think that actually somebody's going to come and kill me. And that would be about now. Okay, I don't like it. I don't like surveillance footage. It always looks creepy. No matter what's happening, you just expect someone's going to get robbed or murdered or F FNAF bear is going to come out and get you. Hey, what up? Is that your face? Hello. Hi, Daniel. I came to return these horror tapes I got last week. Thanks, Daniel. Really good stories, by the way. Thanks for recommending them to me. No problem, Daniel. You know, I can't say no to a good slasher story. Me neither, Daniel. Sometimes I wonder what it'd be like to go out and start chopping heads off and then hang them at the top of my fireplace. Me too, da- The fuck? Nah, I'm kidding. I'd store them at a secret room behind my closet. Haha, <laughs> kidding again. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go now. Murder someone. Wow, what a jokester, Daniel. Thanks, thanks for dropping in. Thanks for stopping by. Please get the fuck out now. Daniel's such a weirdo. Do these go back in the same place every time? Yep. Ding dong, hello. Hello? What is happening? Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. There's a tape here. Was the tape ding donging at me? Who's out there? I'm gonna watch this, but I'm not gonna be happy about it. He was walking back home alone. You would think he had some security with him. With how much money he embezzled, you'd also think he had a nicer house. Excuse me? I wonder what he spent all of that money on, if not security, or a nicer home. I guess I will never find out what our mayor wasted our money on. Oh, I know the sound of a mayor being beheaded, and that's the sound of a mayor being beheaded. Dude, the movie sucked! I'm gonna go down to Letterboxd and give it a terrible review. Who left this? I think it should go now. I don't feel safe anymore. Yeah, that's a good idea. We should head home. Head home to our miserable house. Where you're gonna wake up and forget that you have to go to work again immediately. This is just like real life. You wake up, you work, you sleep, and then you wake up again. <laughs> What was that tape? Was it real? Yeah, you watched it. No, it can't be. It's probably a prank by a kid. <laughs> Good. <laughs> S stupid prank, anyway. It's not, not even scaring me. Shoot, I'm gonna be late again! Oh, now it's raining. That means something bad's gonna happen. Are you a person? You watching me every night? She gets to the bus station. I don't want to be late. Okay. What are those sounds? Not the dog. Oh, it's just cars in the distance. I thought it was like scratching or screeching or scrapping or 
You know? Come on. Come on, I'm about to get murdered out here! Oh, thank God. How do we get home? Is the Every time! This is the third time now and it's still got me! What is wrong with me? And whose cars are these? Is this the... This is the van from before. And it's on! Who's in there? I'll throw a VHS tape at your head! I hope Matt tells me how it went with the girl again, with Mary. Oh, no letters from Matt? Or Greg, or whichever one he was? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, there's a man on the screen. I actually don't know what part of the... place that's facing. Who's out here? I have a tape! Oh no. Oh, do I have to watch it? It's gonna be a scary. That pig was buying groceries with the same bribe money he got today. For someone who's supposed to keep the community safe, he doesn't mind looking the other way when there's money. I don't want to hear it again. That's what all cops are like. A bunch of pigs. So I gutted him like one. Oh, that's much worse! That's much, much, much worse than the last time. The last time it was just implied. This time it's visceral. Hi, welcome to Gooded Like a Pig. Uh, hey. I, I, I'd like to buy these two tapes. The Blade Walker and the Whining. <laughs> uh, hey. D did you see the guy across the street? There's a guy across the street? I just saw the guy behind my building. Why is he looking directly at the store? He, he really freaked me out. Is he a junkie or something? Anyway, thanks for the tapes. If, if I were you, I'd leave right now. Maybe call the police. You should close the store and leave. That is, that is sound advice. That is very good sound advice. I'm, I'm gonna do just that. I'm gonna do just that. Where do they go when they leave? Did they just vanish? I think he's right. I should go now. Yeah... I don't see the dude across the street, though. The bus is late again. Oh, no. Oh, I'm getting uneasy. Shit, this is actually making me anxious. Oh, my God. Huh? I can't interact with it. <laughs> oh, what a nightmare. Was that a dead body or was it an ironing board? God damn it, shut up! Wait, was it the TV making that sound before? Because that's a flat screen. <laughs> you don't really get that sort of sound from it. God, that scared me. Off to work I go, I guess. Having not called the police yet. Rotting apples with wasps feasting, brown bananas with flies retreating, a fox in the night is ripping black, bins bag black bin bags open. Cats are eating a chicken casket after Sunday dinner. A white owl is gobbling. What is this? Death is everywhere. Take a look inside. Don't be ignorant about what you find. Your poems are trash! Absolute dog shit! I'd rather read the back of cereal boxes for the rest of my life. Anyway, now that I've antagonized quite heavily, Let's get the bus to my terrible, terrible, boring, underpaying job. 
where I am totally happy to do this for the rest of my life and I'm not worried about dying alone and poor. Oh, come on, boss. Hurry up now. I want to go to my job so badly. If there's a freak again here, though, then fall for it this time. I remembered. Sure would be nice if I had someone to do these shifts with. Uh, customer! Hello! Like, how is the guy allowed to leave without me being here? How is he allowed to leave every evening? Is that Hannah? Oh my dear, something terrible happened. I didn't know where else to go. I had to come here to speak with someone about it. It's James, my husband. I can't find him anywhere. He went for his usual walk, but he didn't return. He's always back at seven. He's never late. What should I do? Could this serial killer person abduct him? There, there, there's a serial killer going around? It's all over the news. They believe someone is responsible for all these missing people. Oh, Lord. I tried to call the police, but they didn't bother. They have more important cases to investigate. Like what? Oh, Lord, I have to get back. Anna, you shouldn't be out here alone. No, let me walk you out. Anna, let me walk you out. You and your little monkey arms. Bing bong, bing bong. Anna, you get home safe now, okay? I know your husband James is missing and all that, but the stupidest thing you could have done was come here alone at nighttime and walk back home where there's no footpath. Okay. That's that Rob guy again, isn't it? My god, you're tall! Oh no, it's Derek. Hello! I'd like to return these... Man. I hope the weather gets better. Anyway, thanks. Bye. Man, I hope the serial killer doesn't kill me. I wouldn't worry about it. He just kills cereal. Did he not go back in that spot? What's happening? Why is, he, why is there like weird music? Okay, there we go. Hey! Sorry, we're closed for tonight. Why do their arms look like flesh spoons? Sir? Oh, I hate that. Did he leave me a gift? Wait, he's walking back into the woods! Shut up! I don't even know whose car that is! I can't get that to stop! Also, I don't care about your vendetta against the police and the mayor! He did his transactions in that cabin. He ruined so many lives. He wanted to ruin another life today. He wanted to sell them a couple of grams. So, so you got at him for it? Like always? Good thing I'm not a fan of this stuff, but I didn't want him to feel empty-handed. So I cut off his hands. Decided to leave him a small surprise in that little cabin of his. Jesus! What did you leave him? Nuclear bombs? What was that? I'm going home. I'm going home. I hate this. This sucks. This is the worst job I've had in a very, very, very long time. Don't say the bus is late again. Okay. Okay, TV's freaking out. Anything in here? Am I dreaming again? Shut it! Oh, I can go straight to work. Hup! Mm, not today, bussy boy. I hate this job. 
Hey Greg, it's me, your co-worker. I decided to leave Firemore. I guess you won't ever see or talk to me again. Oh well, I never liked this godforsaken town anyway. Crime being on the rise and cops not doing anything about it. People who look dead both on the inside and on the outside. This town deserves people like these. Yeah, I still live here though, so... What are you trying to say? Like, my whole family's from here, I can't really leave. Hey. Oh no, I'm not here to buy tapes. So a noisy guy, a noisy guy outside. He told me to come here and tell you he's given you an invitation. I don't know anything more. He just gave me five bucks to come in here and tell you that. He said you should be very careful with your choice. My, my choice of what? My choices in life are like pizza toppings. Who's out here? The power went off. I have to go and check the breaker box. Where would the breaker box be? They will find you in pieces. Oh, man. Oh, man. I don't want to be found in pieces. <laughs> Breaker box. Oh. Where was it? Man, you climbed up to my camera and wrote that backwards on it for me to see? Great, great, great. What do I do now? Should I go home? I should probably head home. I hate this job. And everything that's coming with it. It was traumatic enough on its own, and now it's even worse. Let's just get out of here. Let's just go home. Let's never come back. Let's join Matt and Mary. Let's just leave Firemore and never ever return. I don't know what you want me to do. But I don't want to go searching for killers. But I'm going to do it anyway. If you climb up onto the roof, he only has one way of getting to you. And that's the ladder. And when he climbs that, you can kick him in the teeth. Oh, there's a tape. Oh, goody. I was just wondering if we got to see another psychopath tape. Oh, joy! Joyous of joys! My day is cured! The depressies will go away after this one, for sure! I love the sound of people being murdered. Prisons are made to hold criminals, yet people like her keep them free. She was out for a walk, proud of winning another case. Okay. Why do I have to watch these? Why are you telling me this? She was the defender of a murderer. So you murdered her? She just needed a little payback. What goes around comes around, after all. That, that may... That's an adequate reaction. Someone defends a murderer in court, gets them off. What do you do? Chainsaw. I is that it? Can I go home now? Can I leave and never come back? Please? Please? I hate it. I don't want to be here. <laughs> yes. And away I go back to my snoozy cabin. Just sit here and drink laundry detergent or something. It's so much better than going to work. Oh man, off I go again. This grind is grueling. I don't want to do it. I want to stay at home. I want to watch TV. I want to get food that's going to make me feel like shit, but it feels so good going in. And I'll regret it later, but I'll still do it again the next day. Just give me my comforts. That's all I ask. Honk! Uh oh. There's someone down there. Hello, motherfucker. What do you want? Yeah, I see you, van man. Probably writing some more of his stupid poetry. Hey, a customer. 
That's quick. Bing bong. Hello. 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 I'm here. I'm working. I'm here. I'm earning my wages. I'm here. Don't worry. I clean my camera. That was nice of him. Hey, Greg. Have you seen Matt? I can't find him anywhere. Oh, Matt didn't leave. That was a letter from the killer telling me he was leaving, but he killed Matt. I haven't heard from him for a week. Really hope he's okay. Come find me after your shift to look at his house. We'll meet at your place. Wait, have all the letters that I've gotten from Matt been from the killer? Or has a week gone by? Was any of this even real? Grow cult strikes again? A oh, crow cult. That makes far more sense than a grow cult. What's a grow cult? Like a bunch of farmers getting together? The crops will grow well this year. Oh, what oh, customer? Shh. Shh. Act professional. Howdy doody. Excuse me. Don't you think it's kind of late to do repairs on the roof? I just saw your co-worker on the roof fixing something. I knew that ladder was going to come in for some reason. Um, I'm all alone here. Who's on the roof? It's not safe. Go right now and tell this man to come down. You fucking go tell him. I don't want to be killed. It's always something. Let me out. It's always something in this damn town. Serial killer? What the hell? Oh boy, another tape. Oh, take the axe, yes! Is he living up here? <laughs> Got medication, flashlight, a lantern, two backpacks. Was- are you literally just living? On the VHS store. Oh, this music is very unsettling. Oh god. Is that Matt's body? <laughs> oh god. Oh god, Matt! Is that a body? Oh, God. You've been quite the fan of my work. Because you keep leaving tapes around, and for some reason I keep watching them. You seem to enjoy my work. I extend this invitation to you. Join me. Let's clean our city from these scums. Call me. I don't want to. <laughs> I just want to go home. I want to watch anime and eat microwavable lasagna. That's it. That's all I want in life. This is why you said make your choice and make a good one. Can I go home now? Wait, I thought we were going to go search for Matt. I need to end this now. Hey, my mirror's back. Uh oh, someone's waiting for me. Where do those tapes come from? Can't go outside. Oh. Duh. Call the police or the unknown number? I really should call the police and get this person taken away, but I feel like the police aren't gonna do anything and. I kind of want to see what happens. The news gave me the name of the abductor. I'm not interested in acts of violence. However, I adore this little rotten town and I will do anything to clean it from the filth. That, that was it? It starts over? I can't even, like, load to get to the other ending? Huh? Ah, oh, what's the point? Oh my god, there's a dog barking outside right now. Wait, was the dog barking in the game or outside my house all this time? Oh my god! Oh, this is a nightmare already. 
This, is, this was just called Be Honest, and it's a quiz thing. And the last time I did one of these, it freaked me out, so... Be fair to the little folks. They are worth it. Okay, by Fuzby. Begin quiz. What kind of toy are you? Enter name. Sean. Fur coats at any price? <laughs> no, thank you. Are you excited to get to know yourself better with this personality test, Sean? Ah, uh, heck yeah! What kind of friend are you? The mom friend? The hot mess? I'm the funny one. I haven't seen you at church. <laughs> Jesus, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I've been busy. I'm a YouTuber now. Jesus, no. Don't be upset with me. Jesus, you have way more cool things going on in your life. You don't have to be trying to canvas me all the time. Of these Smash Mouth lyrics, I would choose... I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. I can't get over Why can't we be friends? I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. So, buddy, You're at a party. Would you be most likely to drink, meet new people, sit by yourself, play games? All of these. Uh, uh, me new people. Sure, why not? I often leave important tasks until the last minute. Strongly agree. Vegetine, the great blood purifier. I always leave stuff to the last second because I have ADHD and doing stuff beforehand paralyzes me. I like to try new things. Uh, yeah. Sure. Schultz's soaps. What color are your eyes? I have blue. You go to a favorite restaurant, what do you order? Oh, an old favorite something new, the healthiest option. Something new. When taking a test, I check all my answers before submitting. Uh, disagree. I do check all my surroundings, though. When taking a train or plane, I try to talk to the person next to me. Strongly disagree. Well, usually I travel with Evelyn, so I'll talk to her, but if it's- If I'm not traveling with her, then no. On an average day, how many hours- <laughs> It said, with me. On an average day, how many hours do you spend alone? 1 to 12? When I'm recording, I guess? I have many neighbors. Eh, uh, not really. Kind of, I guess. I don't know. It is wrong to gossip about someone behind their back. Yeah. I would say strongly agree, because... I, I was brought up in a town that was full of gossip, and I feel like it's just still in me. The, the, like when I hear gossip, there's some part of me that's like, ooh, say more. And I hate it. I don't want to be like that, but my body's like, got any gossip? I think it's human. I never run a red light, even when there's no one around. Um, I don't drive. <laughs> You're in a new room. What kind of seat do you look for? A seat facing the entrance, the comfiest seat, a seat facing the window at the first seat I see. The comfiest. Oh no, Jesus is back. Jesus, you cut out the music. Jesus, why are you here? I'm sorry! I don't go to church anymore. I go to the church of YouTube. When signing, I read all the fine print. No. <laughs> My true name is Sean. Yes. I often write in a journal or diary. No. Out of these artistic movements, which is your favorite? Um, I don't know. Maybe romantics? How many times have you been angry in the last week? Maybe one to three? I don't know. If a stranger approached you in public and asked to borrow your phone, you would politely decline. I'm not letting anyone use my phone. Even if they came up and their legs were like blown off. They're like, I need an ambulance. Can I use your phone? I'd be like, excuse you. I'll call it. <laughs> what is the best kind of animal? I used to say dog, but now I have a cat. Oh, it picked for me. That was weird. It like took control of the mouse. Oh God. Oh God. Jesus. Why are you melting? Your friends asks if you like their shirt. The shirt is ugly. 
What do you do? I'll say that I like this shirt. If they like it, then I like it. It's not up to me. It's whatever they want. It's their taste, not mine. What did that say? Oh. If I went no screens for a day and didn't post to social media or check my phone, my friends or family would be very concerned. Disagree. I often go on breaks from social media. I enjoy people watching. Yes, I do. Oh. Who's watching me, huh? It's you. It's all of you. You're watching me and I can't see you. Interesting. And you must love people watching if you watch my content, right? The next section of the quiz is in the style of free association. Instead of a question, you'll be shown a seed word. You have three seconds to select the word the most associate. Oh, I like this. Paper. Collage? None of those. Seed. Uh, flower. Computer. Internet. Death. Grave? Hearing. Oh. Oh, I don't like that. Stop it. Beseech the... I, d I don't know what to pick for that. Substance. Uh, blood. Circle. Sphere. Declare. Statement. Stop breathing in my ears. Owl. Bird. 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 Constraint. Locks. It may- it was picking the answer for me again. Cast a spell. Defeated. Uh, oh, I didn't answer. This is so creepy, the idea that you're doing a test and someone's watching you. Take a deep breath, just go with your gut, your unconscious will guide you. Whisper. Chills. Actually, ASMR. Ah, uh, chills, because I picked that first. Sea salt. Oh no, sea, uh, ocean sea, <laughs> not sea salt. Dress. Fancy. Oh god, his eyes are gone. Amazing. Happy. What's happening to the doll? Dusty. Old. Ugh. That concludes the first free response portion. Please continue. How many friends do you have? Uh, that depends. There's people I'm friendly with, but maybe not friends with? But I, I have a lot of friends. How many friends do you have if you count me? I am powerful. Oh, angels are powerful, misunderstood, above reproach, messengers of God. That's what angels are. You move into a new apartment. Which do you do first? Go to my shitty job at the VHS store. Uh, set up your bed, hang your curtains, and decorations, meet your new neighbors, set up my bed. I have beautiful eyes. Strongly agree. Look at these beautiful baby blues. Jesus, no! Look, I know I don't go to church anymore, but there's no need to get creepy about it. I would not change much if I was trapped for a hundred years. Um, I would- if I was trapped for a hundred years, I'd probably change a lot. Which of these is most important on a vacation? Uh, uh... I mean, any of these? None of these? Safety. Why not? A white lie is better than telling someone the truth if it would hurt them. I'm neutral on that. Depends on the person. You are in a public area like a park or a lake and see me standing across the way looking at you. You are most likely to, uh, blow you a kiss. This thing is trying to scare me. I'm trying to outdo it. Uh, but I politely ignore you. <laughs> oh, don't do that. Stop. <laughs> You're most likely to lose patience with people who are acting illogically, people who do not finish their work on time, people who talk about confusing art, people who want to talk to me. What kind of job do you have? I entertain people. At least I hope so. <laughs> Everyone's sitting at home like... Don't watch my videos like that, you should be laughing hysterically. A taste that's hard to match. How many times have you seen an owl? 
Have I ever? I've seen an owl in real life. How many times do you think an owl has seen you, Sean? Well, we're talking about you, so we'll say this. Maybe I'm walking home, and there's an owl in the trees that I can't see because they're they're sly. When you take a personality quiz, you learn just as much about me as I do about you. Uh, disagree. I'm confident in my ability to defend myself. Yes. I win most fights I get into. Um, neutral, because some fights that I get into are not worth winning and I should see it from the other person's perspective. I find it hard to work if my surroundings are unorganized. Um, doesn't really matter. We're from the owl country. Good for you. Have you ever cheated in school? I don't think I have. I didn't just. Whoa! What is that? That was cool! I didn't speed up when I have to walk in the dark. Yep. BB the cat is alive. Yes! Don't do anything to BB. I, I hate this. I should have realized that that's what the fucking quiz is trying to do. Must I sever two fond hearts forever? Why are the owls getting divorced? I believe that personality tests provide an accurate summary of a person. I I think there's way more to a person than any personality quiz can tell you. I believe that this is a real personality test made by a real human being. Nope. I have no difficulty separate I have no difficulty separating my dreams from my waking life. Uh yeah, I don't I have no difficulty, yeah. When I think someone is watching me, I feel an awareness at the back of my neck, yeah. Ooh, ah. I don't like that. Jesus, go away! Next section of the quiz is a style of free association. Yes. Clover field. Gouge eye. Yes, gouge the eyes, child. Horn E. Devil. Absent? <laughs> oh, minded. Who's fucking doing a mukbang on the other side of things? Evil... Uh, none of these. Thread. D none of these? Succumb. Eventually. <laughs> Grateful. Journal! Beautiful eyes! Me! Oh, you shouldn't have! Swell! Dandy! That's also me. Window. Glass. Dude, why are you... Get, get off the mic! Thank you! You're not being scary, you're just being weird! Dude, huffing and puffing there. Oh, it's an owl. I would know if something was watching me. Um, yeah, I would, because it keeps showing up on screen. I tended to complete my homework well before it was due. <laughs> no. I'm confident that I will live to be at least 60 years old. Yeah. My dad lived to be like 86, 87, so... What kind of kid were you in high school? Uh, the class clown. The light is blinding, because you haven't been to church. Oh. My friends would still care for me if I was maimed. Yeah? They have to think about what happens. <laughs> That's cool. I like playing horror games in the twilight hours. Yeah! Five more questions to go. Thank you for telling me, because I was getting worried that this was just going to go on forever. People would look for me if I disappeared. Yes. It kind of comes with doing videos like this and pumping out content constantly. Which of the following would be an effective defense against a supernatural entity? Um... Try closing your eyes. If you can't see, it doesn't happen. See? It's not happening to her right now. No evil. What would you characterize your peripheral vision? That's a good question to get you on edge. I can see movement, but not much else. 
I don't notice much in my peripheral vision. My peripheral vision is very good. If you lost... Whoa. If I lost my eyes, what did I replace them with? Oh great, he's back. Um, yeah, if I lost my eyes, I'd sew the hole shut. I often find myself taking care of my friends and family. A lot of the people in my life can take care of themselves. So what kind of toy are you? Oh yeah, I forgot that this is what we were doing. Well, your result is... Candidate! <laughs> Yay! You. 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 I'm a good candidate. I'm gonna be taken over by a demon entity. I'm a good toy. Is it the same questions again? It's the exact same questions again. Oh. Boil sport. Ah, so there actually is other things you can do. You're no fun. Your friends must not like you much. You can't help but ruin anything you see someone else being happy about. Maybe you should reconsider how you interact with others. That's fun. So if you don't answer any of them, it actually gives you a different answer. That's cool! Wait, you guys go play this. It's just called Be Honest. I found it on Itch.io. Um, I want to see what other kind of outcomes you can get out of it by different answers. That was fun! Didn't scare me on the level of like a Watson Scott test, but again, maybe I didn't get all of the endings out of it. Welcome everyone to a game called Missing Hiker, a horror game that I found on Itch.io, looks really cool, I love this aesthetic, and that's it! We're going to December 11th, 1994. Some of you probably weren't even alive back then. I was about to hit five, I was about to hit my prime. Uh, it was looking really good for me in 1994. My brother Ethan is missing for around 24 hours. Well, it's obviously not doing too good for this person. He went on a hiking trip near the Red Mountain. He should have come home yesterday. I went to the local police. They said they don't have the resources for a search right now. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. Okay. Nice. Oh, I'm actually driving. Damn, this is... This is vibes right now. This is chill. Uh, I'm from Ireland, so I'm gonna drive on the left. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't care where this game takes place. It's stuck in my brain that that's where cars are supposed to be. Every time I get into a car in America, I'm like, Oh my god, the steering wheel's on the wrong side! <laughs> it's terrifying. Dude, I know your brother's missing and everything, and we're actually going for a very serious reason, but... This is chill right now. Don't fall asleep, though. I'm assuming I'm, I'm gonna know where to stop. I don't know what those signs are saying. Maybe I should slow down and look at one of them sometime. Maybe if I was actually on the right side of the road, <laughs> I'd read the signs that are laid out for me. Wait, there's a gas station over there, I think. Or as we'd say over here, an old petrol station. Even though there's more than petrol there, but you call it that anyway. Whoa, meow, meow, look out! Christ, this is so chill. This is like, I should park at the gas station to ask if they saw my brother. You know, uh, lo-fi girl who studies? This should be lo-fi guy who drives. Okay, nice. Solid parking job if I do say so myself. Look at that, whoa, what are we driving? A BMW? Damn! I mean, there's no badges or anything on it, but that's a BMW grill right there. We are doing well. Apart from our brother being missing, but at least our finances seem fine. Hello? How much do you want to bet there's a body in the back of this car? Doesn't it just look like that? It looks like there's supposed to be a body in that car. Let me search around first. I've played so many horror games that take place inside convenience stores, petrol stations, that there's always something out the back of them that's gonna get us killed, and I probably have to go up there. Oh. Hello, 
I'm here for, uh... Do you have a body in your care? Tell me. I know you have a body in your care. Tell me who it is. Tell me what you're doing. Is it my brother? Is it my brother, Ethan? Ethan is like a brother to me. Frank Game plays Ethan. He's like a brother to me. Oh, you look sad, though. You look like your brother's missing. What do you want? Uh, I'm searching for my brother. He went missing while hiking in this area. Sorry to offend you, pal, but that's not my problem. I mean, fair, but also, no need to be a dick about it. Also, you shouldn't just randomly approach people like this. Especially in this area. Why? What do you mean? Hey, look, man. I worked pretty late. I was just going to grab some snacks and beers and drive home. I just want to grab some beers and then chill out with my boys. Call of Duty is dropping tonight. We're hopping on, getting on mics. Destiny 2 Lightfall is dropping. Me and the boys are going to raid, okay? Just get some snacks and some brewskis. Some bevies. I'm not in the mood to talk with people I don't know. I understand. Sorry for bothering you. Man. People here are nice. Security camera in use. Where? Oh. Kinda... I always like looking at fake brands in these games. What are, what are we working with? Ah, corn brand corn. And chickpeas brand chickpeas. Diced tomatoes, mayonnaise. Excellent, excellent. Get all the things a person could need on a long drive home, like tins of corn. What can I do for you, sir? I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking around this area. He should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? Well, you didn't give him any descriptors. How's your brother look like? He's brown hair and is pretty tall. He also has a green backpack. Let me think for a second. Hmm. Yes, I think I saw your brother. He came in here and bought a few things. Some water and a few snacks. You're trying to find him? Have you told the police already? Oh, brother. Yes, I did, in fact. But they said they don't have the resources for a search right now. They said they only start a search if a person is missing for more than 48 hours. The I, which I found out is not true, by the way. If you have probable cause that you actually think a person is missing, and you're, you think for sure in your bones that you know that they're gone missing, that they should be at a certain point and they're not, you can report them missing immediately. I think. It isn't the first time someone went missing in this area. Heck, even last week I went missing. Couldn't even find myself. At least a handful of people went missing there in the last decade. People talk a lot. I've heard rumors that there are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So, you should be careful. Especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right behind the gas station leading to the mountain. I told you. Make sure to stay on it. There could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Thanks. I'll make sure to stay safe. Take care. Yeah, what about some cigarettes, some beers, some t Tabasco, uh, tin of peas, uh, some mayonnaise, burger sauce, like... Just give me the whole lot. Give me one of everything in the store. I'll take that to go. Can I look at your cameras, actually? You say there's CCTV in this area. Maybe I can see my brother on it. Man, really wish I took my car. Okay, nobody steal my BMW. Wait, I gotta go lock it. Boop, boop. There, good. <laughs> A door locking mechanism from the 90s. Actually, it is. It is the 90s. It's 1994, right? Ah, yeah, I can tell by the snow. You don't have snow like this these days. Back in my day, snow used to be different. Hello? Actually, I shouldn't draw any attention from bears and whatnot. So atmosphere. I wish I was back in my car. I should have just drove my car up here. The beamer would have no problem with these hills. What's that? A glowing rock? Filled with uranium because it's aliens? My brother's tent looks entirely different. I should take a closer look. Oh, that's a tent. Oh, I don't like this music. Ethan? Oh! oh my god! Whose child is this? Whose disgusting lost child is this? Whoa, whoa, what the f- who the fuck are you? 
You scared the shit out of me. I scared you. I almost had a heart attack myself. I shit a little. What do you want? I hope you're not some kind of pervert or creep. I'm not. I'm looking for my brother. Well, actually, I'm looking for my heart that fell out through my ass. Have you seen it? Should be around here somewhere. He was hiking in this area. Have you seen him? Nope. I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know what he looks like. Look, man, I'm just some guy that likes to hike in a woods. <laughs> and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. I just like a hike in a woods. I haven't seen anyone in days. I understand. You're planning to go deeper into the forest? Yes, yeah, so I'll search around the area. Hoping to find my brother or at least traces of him. Look, you probably think I'm a stoner or something, but... I saw a badger in the woods. But... Last night I had my tent a bit up north. And I heard weird noises coming from the woods. It sounded like a child was crying, but... I didn't see anything. It could be foxes. Have you heard foxes before? They sound like children... Like going... <laughs> it creeped me out. Maybe it was a cryptid. Sure. A what? Look, man, do you carry? I mean, I can. I'm pretty strong. I carried my mom's groceries in since I was like six years old. What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece, you know? Something for protection. Oh! Like condoms. Oh, you mean a gun? <laughs> no, I don't. Then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the forest at night. If I was carrying a gun out here, I probably would have shot you in the head once you showed up. But I'm not going to stop you. I just want to sleep now. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up a tent in the woods at night ever again. I almost would have shot you. Well, I'm ge I guess I'm glad you didn't. Me too. Good look at the search. You tiny child. I could lay you out with a single flick of my baby finger. Stick both my fingers in your nostrils and drag you across the snow. Anyway, see you later. Oh, this scared the crap out of me. I could probably find my brother dead and it would be less scary than what just happened to me. Oh, that's deathly dark without my light. Let's just leave that on. Why is that guy hiking and camping alone in the woods? Do people do that? I've never... I guess I'm just not a camping kind of person. I don't go camping very often. And any time I have, I didn't really like it. It's cold. It's, it's uncomfortable. There's no coffee shops around, like... <laughs> I do like the idea of it, though. Being cozy in a tent. But I just know that uh, being out in the woods is just not nearly as comfortable as being at home in my house. Plus, there's no video games out here. Slenderman? My brother better be out here. If he's not... There's so much walking. I mean, I get it. He's your brother. Familial love. Blood thicker than water and all that kind of stuff. But... Getting real tired. It's getting really cold. I should set up tent on the left side of the road. Wait, you brought a tent? Also, why didn't he come out during the day? <laughs> My fingers are pretty numb. It's hard to build the tent. Damn, I forgot my sleeping bag. Whoa! This is the BMW of tents. That other guy's tent back there, he doesn't even know. This is an incorporated tent. So much better than that loser's little green pea pod. This is sick. I bet it's like twice as big on the inside too. Yep. Roomy. It's cold, but I'm falling asleep slowly. Uh, that's hypothermia. <laughs> Be careful now. You didn't even take out a sleeping bag or anything. I think I heard someone scream. Not sure if it was real or imagined. That actually does sound like foxes. That's how foxes sound. I need to check. Could be my brother screaming for help. 
Could be. Could also just be a murdering psychopath in the woods. The light deeper in the woods. I need to see if it could be my brother. Okay, that's not a fox. That is legitimately someone just screaming at the top of their lungs. Hey! Ethan! Do not be an altar with a naked man body on it ready to summon the Antichrist. Wait, it's a house. Whoa, it looked way smaller from back there. I know that's how that works. Small, far away. <laughs> you know what I mean. I'm coming, bro! Don't you worry. I've got a tent set up. We're gonna be okay. Unless you're the one screaming because you're getting your legs chopped off. Oh, flashlight, don't fail me now. Hello? That's my brother's backpack. He must have been here. Weird, the backpack is completely empty. Nothing in here. Uh-oh. Okay. It was fine until right now. Hello? Oh god, I hate this. This feels like Blair Witch Project. Is there not a generator? Nope. Is that blood? Oh no! My bro! What the hell? Someone made a picture of my tent and my car. Oh no. Oh, that's a sure sign to get out of here. I bet that's a piece of my brother. He cut up my brother and now he's like, eat your brother. Okay, nothing else is clickable. Oh! Oh my god! Your body was never found. Cool! So happy about that! Oh, sweet mother of God! That does it! Thank you for watching this. Did you enjoy the video? Great. If you watched this video and you enjoyed it, are you likely to recommend it to a friend? Excellent. If you keep watching this channel, your chances of getting happy are increased. Thank you for taking the test.